There we go. Hello, today we are demonstrating the ASTM D732 shear fixture for plastics. So we're going to start off by making our samples. We do that on an arbor press and cutting die here. So I already have our stack of five samples. These have the 11 millimeter hole in the center. So you can use either square or circular samples. Today we're using square. We're going to use a stack of five of these. So we go ahead and place it on the base of the fixture. Now we have our puncture plunger here. I'm going to go ahead and put it on, flip it around. We're going to get the nut to attach onto the bottom here. So it's kind of tight, but if you're having difficulty, you can just use a socket wrench to get it done for you. So go ahead and tighten that on. All right. Now we want to come with the top. Put the top on just like that. We have our washers and our four set screws. So we'll go ahead and tighten those. All right, so there's our fixture all set up and ready to go. Now it should be able to hang just like this. So what we're going to do is go ahead and Place it onto the top adapter here, attached to our load cell. Tighten down that jam nut so we have a nice secure connection. So that should hang. We're going to go ahead and remove our bottom adapter so it's a nice flat base here. All right, now we're ready to test. So what's going to happen is this is going to come down. It's going to hit the bottom of the machine and it's going to puncture through our five samples here. Once it does that, we can release and uh, measure the load, and we have our test. So that's it for the ASTM D732 shear fixture for plastics. If you have any questions about how to do this test, lead time quotes, availability, just send us a message on the web. Thanks. Have a great day.